Hi guys, hope you're well. Welcome to Do Daily. Des here. Who's ready for some Monday motivation? Even on a wet, miserable bank holiday like today. But we're not going to let that bother us, are we? Lots to be positive about, lots to look forward to. I had hoped this week to bring you some Do Daily from the sunny Skegness coast. I mentioned last week I'm away for a few days, you know, taking some time getting away from lots of the normal things but also um, having that little bit of time to do the things they enjoy and do some of the things that we're allowed to do again because whilst it's not perfect right now we are getting that opportunity and despite the weather today despite being cooped up in the caravan you know the stereotypical scene for the British bank holiday you know we had a really nice week really enjoyed some of the things I've done with Kay we've managed to get out and about do you know and like I say while it's not quite the same do you know it's still worth doing it's still worth trying to enjoy yourself the weather's not been perfect but it's been better better than today but today just gives us that opportunity as well doesn't it just to sort of sit back and take a bit of time always talk about busy lives getting on top of us do you know and attacking the week in the right frame of mind this week with the extra day of the bank holiday kind of an enforced break has been placed upon us do you know and like i say we'd love to show you some of the places some of the, the seafront and such things like that but i've just found a a kind of small enclosed little piece of grass which is surrounded by trees and the wind's not going to overtake absolutely everything i would have done it from inside today but of course i have to get out and get my steps in for the uh, do one in steps challenge do you know last man standing today's going to be a real test for some of the guys i guess but i'm not letting the weather bother me i say it every time it rains skin's waterproof and it should never stop us doing our activity do you know it needs doing regardless but you always feel even more epic for doing it do you know so whilst i'm getting a bit wet now i'm getting soaked I'm looking forward to an evening, a few drinks, a bit of nice food with Kay, you know, just getting warm, watching all the things we watch on TV, you know, and making the absolute most of it, because that's what we have to do. Do you know, this is just a, a small trip away, probably done it a hundred thousand times in my life, you know, getting away to the East Coast, but it's so important, isn't it, just to take that time and do whatever works for you. I, I kind of made a comment on my own social media on one, a post over the weekend about enjoying your lot. Do you know, if this is all we've got right now, do you know, I enjoy spending time with Kay. I enjoy walking, I enjoy getting out there in all weathers, do you know, working to these challenges. Then I'm going to enjoy my lot, do you know, that, that's, that's what I'm about, that's what it is. I do daily sort of fantastic focus to, for me to keep sort of remembering that keep keep thinking forward and keep planning to get it all in even when I don't quite feel like it today will be so easy to knock it on the head saying really I don't want to sort of push on but we can't do that on a Monday can we we have to never miss a Monday do you know and we can't control the weather and what what do I always say let's not be controlled by that either as ever on a Monday what I like to do is run down the offerings I'll be as brief as I possibly can because of the conditions. Um, tomorrow we've got Tuesday training. Hopefully the weather picks up. It's supposed to somewhat, you know, from the forecast. Wherever you are, you can take part in whatever activity you choose. If you join us at 6.30, it's just a great show of solidarity, you know, doing the things we love together, working part of a team. Whilst Monday's all about getting out there and really sort of, Hitting the week hard, whatever the circumstances. Tuesdays are about coming together as, as a community and giving it a real go. Because we always know if we have that little bit of accountability, if we work off the inspiration and motivation of others, it can be just the trick in getting us out the door. Wednesday, I'll have more on the current Wednesday workout challenge. Of course, I've already mentioned it, but over the weekend, we have seen a few fallers. Some really, really good efforts. And uh, whilst everyone was going along strong at the back end of last week, for one reason or another, uh, people just can't carry on, can they? What I will say to those, and something I say to 
all the people I coach, all the people that get involved with the activity I do, it doesn't matter, does it? Because we go again, do you know? Ultimately, it doesn't matter if I do 9,999 steps today or 10,001, do you know? Because there's not much difference. But what the 10,000 figure gives us is accountability. So if you didn't quite see it through, do you know, if you didn't get as much activity in at the weekend, do you know, we get that opportunity to do it again. You can never, never fail to succeed with this kind of thing. You can always succeed to fail, you know, just by doing nothing. So it's important to remember that. But I'll have more details of the Wednesday workout and what all that's about. And look at a new mini challenge for May. And then on Thursday, it's Thursday 4, it's your chance to ask me questions. Absolutely anything you want about what I'm doing, what I'm feeling, you know, about the pandemic, about how I approach different things in life. Do you know, really, really enjoyed last week's episode. Try, I'll try to be as interactive as I was then. Do you know, made it a lot more fun. Do you know, a, a much more sort of, it, I got much more out of it in the end. So that was a, a good one. Check that out. Do you know, keep posting your questions on any of the social media links, on any of the videos this week, or at, uh, or des at dorunning.org.uk. I'd love to answer those. And of course, check out that throwback question if you've not seen the episode. Your chance to sort of put your name to something. All I do is kind of read a few of the answers out at the start of the episode. Again, just to sort of pass on how others are doing it. It's not all about me or do running or one person. It's about absolutely everybody, isn't it? And getting the absolute most from activity. And then on Friday, I'll be waking up to walk. I mentioned last week that I'm looking to do a lot more distance on wake up to walk this week i'll be off in search of robin hood on the robin hood trail no sightings of him so far so if i get plenty of miles in surely i'm gonna uh, surely i'm gonna see him somewhere do you know and i've got a route in mind but already really looking forward to that that comes sort of the day after my birthday it's my birthday this week so whilst i'm gonna have a nice night on Thursday after the video and then sort of get up and walk and, and make the most of that do you know it all feels like a bit of a treat having this time off do you know having chance to go somewhere different to walk a bit longer do you know and I'll take those as birthday treats these days I don't need material things I don't need thing, superficial things do you know I just need a bit of time to enjoy the things I'm doing do you know and if that means getting out in the rain to try and build my steps up on a wet Monday in Skegness, then absolutely that's what I'm going to do. And I just want to sort, sort of to sort of let you know how I'm approaching it today, of course, with the weather, it's playing a big part in what I'm doing, but it's important just to keep going, isn't it? So no real song message other than just get out there. Do you know, whether you've not done activity, whether you're looking to start, sorry, the camera was wet. <laughs> Whether you're just looking to start, use it as an opportunity to get out there. Whether you're looking to get back into it, you know, we always know when we do it on a Monday, you know, and if you can get involved in any of that activity, it's brilliant for keeping you going. And then, or whether you're just looking in, you know, just keep listening to what's going on through Do Daily, what activities available, different ways that we approach it, you know, because it's really important. And like I said, at some point during today's episode don't be defined by the things you can't control so if we get out there to you know really attack this weather come back whether you've gone for a walk around the block you know whether you've gone for an epic run or a long bike ride you know you can sit back like, like i said i'm going to you know get warm wrap up watch tv sit back in the knowledge that you've really really made the most and attack the week and if you wake up tomorrow feeling like you've done that and I can, I can assure you you'll want to carry it on if you kind of put it off today you might think well I can't really be bothered with a solidarity session this week and then you get to Wednesday and you're like well should I do should I continue with the steps do you know and before you know it you're starting to feel sorry for yourself things are getting on top of you and all because it was raining on a Monday and that's not what we're about are we whilst it's about beginners, absolutely anybody at, at whatever sort of 
point you are with your activity, with your exercise or with your mental health, do you know, the one thing we don't have to be controlled by is the crappy weather, do you know? So give it a go, I can assure you. I'm going to uh, sign off, not, not too long today, of course, for obvious reasons, but I'm going to sign off shortly. I'm going to get back, do you know, really wrap up and uh, hopefully for the next couple of t next couple of days i'm here i can make the most of it i can do some some more of those things i've enjoyed to this point do you know and keep sort of enjoying my week off building up to my birthday and feeling like it's a bit of a reward for hard work perseverance i will just say thank you to absolutely everybody that subscribes to do daily uh, been trying to achieve it for weeks now getting up to 100 subscribers doesn't mean a great deal just a small target one of those small wins i've been looking to achieve do you know i'll set another one and keep working at it um but absolutely thank you to everyone i've got there i looked at the uh, number last night and it had hit that magical 100 number doesn't mean a great deal like i've just said but it's uh, it's important to me and when i feel like i'm Sort of achieving things doing things do you know doing something i love do you know, that's all that matters isn't it do you know we don't need all those superficial and unimportant things that we think we need at times we need something that puts a smile on the face and that really put a smile on my face so once again thank you have a great weekend hope you uh, enjoyed the weekend too i'll check back in before the solidarity session I'll be out there looking to get a run in, hopefully along the seafront, you know. So if you can join me and the rest of the guys, tag us in with whatever you're doing, you know, get your yellow t-shirts on if you can, just to so show some form of solidarity, show that you're giving it a real go. Until tomorrow, guys, just doing it.